Today I'm going to show you how to make peppermint bark, which is a family favorite of ours. We love to make it at the holidays. We give it as gifts to our neighbors and just eat it at home. So the first thing I did was I melted about 10 ounces of semi-sweet chocolate chips. And I melt them just in the microwave at 30 second intervals, stirring um, after each 30 seconds. And it comes out nice and smooth. And I'm just going to pour this onto this cookie sheet that I have lined with parchment paper. Once you have it spread nice and thin into a nice large rectangle, you just put it in the fridge for a few minutes. Okay, and do that real fast. And while that's chilling, I am going to, well, I already broke up about 12 candy canes. Um, just used a put them in a Ziploc bag and broke them up into pieces and then I'm going to melt the white chocolate chips. I have about 12 ounces of white chocolate chips here that I'm just going to melt in the microwave the same. Now the chocolate has been in the fridge for just about five minutes and I've broken up the candy canes and I've heated my white chocolate in the microwave. So I'm just going to pour this on kind of in strips and you have to do this a little bit fast because it's going to start melting the dark chocolate. Now that I've spread the white chocolate out, I'm going to place the chunks of candy cane on there and gently press them in. And now you let it cool for about 45 minutes in the fridge. And then you'll be able to just ready to break it up into pieces. Now this has been in the fridge for about 45 minutes to an hour and it's nice and hard so I'm going to take it out and you can just peel the parchment paper right off and start breaking it right into pieces and laying them in the water. And that's all, all you have to do to make peppermint bark for your family and friends this holiday season. You better watch out.